Hi Taurus, this is Wendy. Welcome to my channel, Wendy's Tarot. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards, why is your person holding back from you? Why is your person holding back from you? All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's get started. Spirit, please show me why is this person holding back from Taurus, whoever it is that Taurus is connecting to and dealing with in love. Why is this person holding back from Taurus? Okay, first card we have for you, Taurus, is the tower. The tower. You might be dealing with a Scorpio for some of you. So something um, traumatic or um, unexpected might have happened in this person's life. Something impacting, something um, just out of the blue. Hmm, we'll see. What else? We have here the Seven of Wands. I'm only um, reading upright uh, position, okay? Seven of Wands here. So Seven of Wands does represent someone who is pushing the other person away or blocking um, the other person away or pushing someone away. due to whatever unexpected event happened here. Okay, we'll clarify in a little bit. What else? Nine of Swords, this person is stressed out. They feel stressed, they feel worried, they feel concerned. Um, hmm. We'll clarify that. We have here the world. Something ended here with the world card, something and maybe it was unexpected with that tower. Something unexpectedly ending or there was some sort of epiphany or realization or some sort of uh, revelation. Let's see what else. We have the Four of Swords. This person, um, they, fe they felt like they needed a break from all of this intensity. There was just too much intensity surrounding this person that... It's like they needed some time off. They needed some time to recuperate or recover. What else? And we have the death card. Again, something ended here with the death card, the world, and the tower. These are three pretty intense energies here, intense cards. And it, it might, again, it might have been something unexpected, something they weren't planning it, for it to end. All right, let's clarify because I want to know what's going on here. <laughs> All right, Spirit, tell me about this tower card. Tell me more information about this tower card, please. And we have here the Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords. That's the same card that came came out here, the Nine of Swords. So whatever it is, it created a lot of a lot of grief. A lot of grief. Okay, what else? And we have the Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords. This is the runner. So this person ran away from they ran away from some sort of 
event situation or revelation here with the tower card they couldn't handle the intensity of it okay hopefully this makes sense to you because it doesn't make any sense to me <laughs> what about the seven of wands spirit tell me about the seven of wands we have the lovers the lovers so i'm guessing this would be you then taurus there they blocked you the lovers and the seven of wands they blocked you they pushed you away maybe they were angry at you here yeah i'm feeling a little bit of anger here someone someone got angry at the other person what is this nine of swords spirit actually should i get one more card for this Give me one more card for Seven of Wands. We have the Ace of Swords. Some sort of truth, some sort of epiphany, or re not epiphany, but some sort of truth came out, some sort of revelation. I don't know what kind of truth is that, but yeah, I feel like this person learned some sort of truth about you, Taurus. Uh, Keep in mind, roles can be reversed. Maybe this is you who I'm talking about. Sometimes the energies can get mixed up. What about the Nine of Swords, Spirit? This is the Four of Swords. Yeah, we already have that one here. So they took some time off to recover, to... Um, I don't know, to recover or to to heal yeah this person definitely feels like they just needed everyone to leave them alone like they just they needed some time off like their mind was driving them crazy you know all right what about the world clarify the world we have here the two of swords two of swords so they're not sure they're two of swords means they're not sure whether they want something to end or not with the world card they feel conflicted in regards to complete um, completing a cycle here or ending a cycle what is the four of swords here spirit clarify four of swords we have here the hierophant the hierophant this is a card of marriage, so for some of you, um, this could, whatever revelation happened here with the Ace of Swords could be due to um, somebody being married already with the Hierophant. Give me another card for the Four of Swords. We have here the Six of Swords. Walking away from a marriage or from a commitment. So for some of you, um, yeah, marriage or commitment is why this person walked away. Maybe um, they they found out that you had a, a commitment elsewhere. There was a third party situation. Give me one card for death. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. We have Ten of Pentacles with the Death card. So, again, this this Ten of Pentacles is the card of commitment, marriage, um, family, children. So, I'm getting a specific message here that this person found out that um, maybe you were already involved. You already had a, a commitment and they ran away from you. And they're not sure if they want to close this cycle with you or keep it open. Hmm. <clears throat> Let me get one more for Four of Swords. Yeah, one, one more for Four of Swords. Yeah, Two of Pentacles. They're indecisive here. Should I, should I abandon this or should I stay? Give me one more for the Tower card the tower we have the queen of swords a lot of sword energy here with the tower 
So it's like some sort of information came to light. Some sort of truth, some sort of revelation. Okay, I'm going to end the reading here, Taurus. I hope this resonates. If it did, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Take care.